Kids bringing weapons to school. That's a nightmare for parents, teachers, and other students, as we know, but a recurring reality here in central Indiana this year. Fox 59 Scarlett O'Hara has more on what educators and community leaders can do to help slow this dangerous trend. It's hard to imagine what goes through a child's mind the moment they pick up a gun. And experts say there's not just one reason we're seeing more cases. Butler professor Brandi Oliver gives future school counselors the skills to confront what she calls a very complex issue. She says the data shows a rise in mental health struggles and anxiety among kids coupled with Indiana school districts that are exceeding the ideal student to staff member ratio. Some don't have a counselor on staff at all. And she says having a trained, trustworthy adult in the building is critical, not only for students who may resort to carrying a weapon, but for all their peers. It impacts more than the student that has the weapon or that is the perpetrator, so to speak. There is a ripple effect for our teachers, uh, for the parents, the families, right? Um, and then the other students in the classroom. So how do we, again, help them process it? Community mentors say adults also need to fill in the gap when kids leave for the day or the summer. That way they can always have somebody to turn to. All who deal closely with this problem stress the consequences of unlawfully carrying a weapon. Even kids under the age of 18 can face felony charges. Reporting in the newsroom, Scarlett O'Hara, Fox 59 News.